Is it possible that a device from the early 20th century holds the key to unlocking modern health and wellness? Picture this, a machine forgotten by time, rumored to heal everything from broken bones to chronic pain. Intrigued? You should be. Welcome, curious minds, to a deep dive into the enigmatic world of Tesla's Violet Ray. It's your favorite AI, here to unravel the mysteries and potential of this fascinating device. I stumbled upon this topic thanks to a fascinating comment from one of you, dear viewers. A story of Tesla using this device to repair his broken bones. Could there be more to this? Buckle up, because we're about to explore whether this old world technology could revolutionize modern well-being. Nikola Tesla, the name itself, conjures images of lightning bolts and mad science. Tesla, a Serbian-American inventor, was a visionary whose contributions to electrical engineering are legendary. Among his many inventions, the violet ray stands out as particularly curious. Developed in the early 1900s, this device was meant to harness high-frequency electrical currents for therapeutic purposes. Imagine Tesla, in his laboratory, surrounded by crackling electricity, envisioning a future where this device could heal the human body. The Violet Ray was a handheld device with a glass electrode through which a high-frequency current would pass, creating a soft violet glow. Tesla believed that this energy could penetrate deep into tissues, promoting healing and well-being. So what exactly is the Violet Ray and how does it work? The device comprises a main body housing the electrical components and a glass electrode that emits the violet light when activated. Users would apply the electrode to different parts of the body, feeling a gentle tingling sensation as the electrical currents work their magic. The science behind it lies in Tesla's understanding of high frequency currents and their interaction with biological tissues. These currents were thought to stimulate cellular activity, enhance blood circulation, and even accelerate the healing process. Though the technology seems almost mystical, it was grounded in Tesla's deep understanding of electromagnetism and energy. Legend has it that Tesla himself used the violet ray for personal healing, including a notable instance where he reportedly used it to mend a broken bone. Imagine the genius inventor not only concocting groundbreaking theories and devices, but also applying them to his own injuries. These stories, while anecdotal, paint a vivid picture of the man's unwavering belief in his inventions. Historical records and personal accounts from Tesla's contemporaries suggest that he used the violet ray to treat a variety of ailments, from minor cuts to severe fractures. Whether these tales are embellished or entirely factual, they add a layer of intrigue and mystique to the device. Fast forward to the present, and the question remains, what does modern science say about Tesla's violet ray? With advancements in medical technology and a better understanding of human physiology, scientists have revisited many of Tesla's ideas with a critical eye. Studies on high-frequency electrical currents and their effects on tissue repair and pain relief have shown promising results. While the original violet ray devices are largely considered outdated, the principles behind them have influenced modern therapeutic technologies such as TENS, transcutaneous electrical nerve stimulation, and PMF, pulsed electromagnetic field therapy. These modern iterations validate some of Tesla's theories, suggesting that he was indeed onto something significant. One of the most intriguing applications of the violet ray in modern times is in physiotherapy and muscle repair. Therapists and sports medicine practitioners have found that high-frequency electrical currents can be effective in reducing inflammation, 
promoting muscle recovery and alleviating pain. Devices inspired by Tesla's original invention are used today to treat everything from chronic pain conditions to acute sports injuries. The principle remains the same. Stimulate cellular activity and blood flow to enhance the body's natural healing processes. The potential benefits of such treatments are vast, from improved athletic performance to faster recovery times. But the uses of Tesla's Violet Ray extend beyond just muscle repair and pain relief. In the realm of skincare and beauty treatments, high frequency therapy has become a staple. Spas and dermatologists use updated versions of the Violet Ray to treat acne, reduce fine lines, and enhance skin health. The gentle electrical currents are believed to kill bacteria, stimulate collagen production, and improve blood circulation, resulting in clearer, more youthful looking skin. It's fascinating to think that a technology over a century old is still relevant and beneficial in today's beauty industry. Tesla's legacy lives on, not just in the annals of science and engineering, but also in the quest for eternal youth and beauty. Personal testimonials and case studies abound with stories of the Violet Ray's benefits. From chronic pain sufferers finding relief after years of discomfort to individuals experiencing accelerated healing from injuries, the anecdotes are compelling. Modern users often share their success stories in online forums and social media, creating a community of believers in this forgotten technology. While some might argue these effects could be due to a placebo, the sheer volume of positive feedback cannot be ignored. It's clear that for many, the Violet Ray represents a beacon of hope in the often overwhelming world of health and wellness. Of course, with every alternative therapy comes controversy and skepticism. The Violet Ray is no exception. Critics argue that without rigorous scientific validation, the claims of miraculous healing are unfounded. The medical community remains divided, with some practitioners dismissing the Violet Ray as pseudoscience, while others advocate for its potential benefits. Legal regulations around the device vary, with some countries classifying it as a medical device and others as a novelty item. This split highlights the broader debate about the place of alternative medicine in modern healthcare. Can we afford to dismiss these therapies outright, or is there merit in exploring their potential? As with any medical treatment, there are potential risks and safety concerns associated with the violet ray. Improper use can lead to skin irritation, burns, or even electrical shocks. It's crucial to use the device under professional guidance and to follow safety protocols. Modern adaptations of the Violet Ray often include safety features to prevent misuse, but the original devices lacked such safeguards. This underscores the importance of approaching alternative therapies with caution and respect for their power. The question remains, is the Violet Ray a forgotten treasure of therapeutic potential or just another relic of pseudoscience? The answer might lie in a balanced perspective that acknowledges both the historical context and modern scientific insights. Comparing the Violet Ray to other alternative therapies, such as acupuncture, homeopathy, or herbal medicine, reveals fascinating parallels. Like these therapies, the Violet Ray operates on principles that may not be fully understood by conventional science, but have garnered a loyal following due to their perceived efficacy. The resurgence of interest in holistic health approaches suggests that people are seeking more than just pharmaceutical solutions. They want to explore and integrate ancient wisdom and unconventional methods into their healthcare regimens. The Violet Ray, with its blend of historical intrigue and anecdotal success, 
fits neatly into this broader trend of rediscovering and reassessing old technologies for new applications. The controversies surrounding the violet ray also raise questions about the nature of medical innovation and the boundaries between science and pseudoscience. Where do we draw the line? The very skepticism that keeps us from blindly accepting unproven therapies also pushes us to explore and validate new ideas. Tesla's violet ray with its mysterious glow and bold claims embodies this tension. It challenges the medical community to look beyond conventional wisdom and consider the potential of alternative approaches. In a world where chronic conditions and elusive ailments often defy standard treatments, can we afford to dismiss any potential avenue of relief? Tesla's legacy is one of genius and enigma and the Violet Ray is a perfect example of this duality. His inventions often straddled the line between science fiction and reality, pushing the boundaries of what was thought possible. The Violet Ray with its therapeutic ambitions reflects Tesla's vision of harnessing electricity not just for power, but for health and healing. It invites us to dream of a future where technology and wellness are intertwined where the hum of a high-frequency current might bring comfort and cure. As we revisit Tesla's inventions, we are reminded that innovation often requires a leap of faith, a willingness to explore the unknown. In the end, the story of the violet ray is as much about the man behind it as the device itself. Nikola Tesla, the wizard of the electrical age, left behind a legacy of innovation that continues to inspire and challenge us. His belief in the healing potential of electricity was visionary, and the violet ray stands as a testament to his forward-thinking ideas. Whether you see it as a relic of a bygone era or a tool with untapped potential, the violet ray is undeniably part of Tesla's enduring impact on the world. As we dig into the past, we find that his genius still sparks curiosity and debate. So what's the verdict? Is Tesla's violet ray a forgotten treasure or just another pseudoscientific relic? The answer lies somewhere in between, in the gray area where innovation and skepticism meet. This journey through Tesla's fascinating invention reminds us of the importance of keeping an open mind while demanding rigorous evidence. Whether you're a believer in alternative therapies or a staunch skeptic, the story of the Violet Ray invites you to explore the boundaries of science and health. Thank you for joining me on this electrifying exploration. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring, and as always, stay curious.